In this quick Filmic Pro tutorial, I'm going to show you how to set up presets and three specific presets that will save you time. Alright, so the first preset that we want to set up is a 4K resolution at 30 frames per second because this will be one of the common presets you'll use on a regular basis. So we're set to 4K here. Next we're going to check the frame rate and it's set to 30 frames per second. That's perfect. And then I'm just going to double check the white balance and make sure that it's on auto white balance lock on record, which is the orange option. This is the one that kind of just saves you because it'll take a reading right when you hit the record button and then it'll lock in your white balance so there's no changes during your recording. So next I'm going to go into presets and save current values to preset and I'll call this 4K 30 FPS and just click done. The next preset we're going to create is a 4K at 60 frames per second, if you have that available, this depends on what device you're using. Now nothing else has changed, so I'm going to keep this the way it was. White balance is still on automatic white balance on record. So we'll go into settings, presets. If you're not familiar with the differences between frame rates, a 30 frames per second video is better for talking head videos or anything where you're just like you're speaking on camera, interviews, things like that. If you're going to use 60 frames per second, it's likely because you're trying to capture visual shots, also known as B-roll, where you basically are just getting visuals. There's no speaking on that part of the video. And you can use that to accentuate your story or highlight something in your video. So that's why you want to use 60 frames or 30 frames per second. The last preset that we'll create is a 1080p at 30 frames per second. This is probably another one that I'm going to use. The reason why I might use a 1080p resolution is I just need a really quick video or maybe you're just trying to film something that doesn't take up much storage space on your phone or the device and you really want to be able to edit it really fast. When you shoot in a 1080p versus a 4K resolution, it makes a huge difference in how much space it's going to take up and how quickly you're going to be able to edit the video because it takes more processing power for the device that you're going to be editing on. And we'll save that preset. So the last thing you might want to set up here is a Filmic Pro account and this enables you to save all your presets to the cloud so you never really lose them. If you switch devices or you want to be able to sync your presets, we just click sync and now it's uploaded three presets to the cloud. And if I check presets, I'll have a bunch more in here that I had created previously and uploaded. If you'd like to delete your presets, just press and hold on the menu item you can delete local or you can also delete local and cloud if you want to get rid of that preset entirely. Other things you might want to set presets for are things like the white balance controls in here. Say you want to go for more of like a cold or a warm look in your videos. So you would actually move this guy around here and you would place it and then you can see the difference this makes. So we're looking pretty blue here. It's nice and cold and basically I could save that if that's a kind of style or look I'm looking for and save that as a preset give it a good name so that it matches so those are your three presets if you'd like any more assistance with Filmic Pro check out these videos over here as always I want to thank you so much for watching this video if you haven't subscribed to the channel yet please make sure you do smash that thumbs up button and I can't wait to see you creating a big impact with your videos